Welcome back everybody. Well, I got a box today that uh, we've ordered and it is from Count On Tools. Not opened it. I ordered um, a while back. You guys have known my love for these PB Swiss uh, screwdrivers. I've used these uh, on eyeglasses, uh, computers, uh, audio video equipment. Uh, the the number zero and the double zero um, Phillips had work awesomely. The um, eyeglasses, the whatever the size, I don't know, the second size flat blade in eyeglasses work perfectly. I mean, you put it in there and it holds the screw. It's really good. So if you guys don't know about this PB Swiss set of... Um, precision screwdrivers uh you need to go out and you need to go out and get a set these work awesomely now if you don't work every day with them or kind of a tool junkie um you can kind of use every anything you want but if you want a really good set so one of the things i do love about these is the more and more i use them the better they become and the swiss grip the more i interact with it the better it becomes it's it's amazing so i ordered some screwdrivers here today uh i'm a i'm you know for regular screwdrivers i'm normally a klein guy you're either a south wire or a clown or or a uh, klein guy and uh you know if if uh you know a screwdriver that you don't use every day there's a myriad of different stuff i know a lot of guys are buying milwaukee and stuff like that but I went through Count On Tools, and uh, I wanted a, a number two Phillips, and I wanted, uh, I think it's a number four uh, slotted, uh, so that when I do uh, face plates and stuff like that. So let's uh, get closer, we'll open this up, and uh, we'll see, because I've not seen it, so you and I, were all getting it together. So let's, uh, let's open this up and see what came. <laughs> I'm excited. All right, so let's go check this out. So one of the things that I wanted with this, as I, as I said, is I wanted a, um, a screwdriver that was not a chisel tip. Okay, can you see the tip of that where it is a straight, all the way through the blade, okay? They have a thing called a parallel edge, and when they mean parallel edge, they mean the waist of this is parallel all the way through. It doesn't flare out, okay? And this is, okay, this is a straight ground. This is where you would find um, where this tip itself, what I'm talking about is this tip in here, okay, is straight. You'll notice as you look closely to it, this has a... Um, um, a little little ridge to it and that little ridge is where it goes from a chisel to a straight okay so it goes through and this this point itself is straight so it goes into the fastener it goes in the fastener like this it's not a chisel tip so a chisel chisel tip is like this 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 edges this edge goes straight down as opposed to a chisel tip that comes in so it grips the entire fastener all the way down. This is why I like this style. And I've not found it in the Klein stuff that I've gotten. They may make a version of it that's square. But I've never been able to find any. Um, but these are not the you know high torque fastener. And they're not the strike tip. I don't want the strike tip. If I got a hammer the back of this, I'm using the wrong tool. I do like again this 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 Swiss grip is uh, it just fits your hand nice the the length of the handle is nice it's not too big it can fit in the palm um, that goes through and you can really feel that you have a lot of so the cool thing about it okay so so the model number of this one is called a 8140 okay which is 
This is the the, the catalog of it. It's 8140, okay, slash 4, okay. The slash 4 denotes the size of the tip, dash 250, which is the length of the blade, okay. This is 250 millimeters. This is a little long. Maybe I should have gotten 100 millimeters, but I wanted to see. I've never gotten these long ones, and my clients are... Uh, I forget what they are, but they're they're about half of this length. Okay, so that's for that. This uh, Phillips number two is called an 8190 slash two because this is a number two Phillips slash um, hyphen 250 dash seven. I'm not sure what the dash seven means, but this is uh, another 250 millimeter. So you'll notice on here I've got my grubby poles on there. Its finish is really nice. So, what you'll notice on here is it will tell you that this is, you can see, a PH2, and it is also serialized. Everything that you get from PB Swiss is serialized. Even on these little ones, you'll notice that these are laser etched in with a serial number as well. Well balanced. It, it's, it really feels good in hand. So, that's the Phillips, and then the slotted okay it's not a straight slot okay uh that's like saying a hot water heater you don't heat hot water you heat water so it's a water heater so this is a number four as you can see on the blade and it is also serialized of what you can see right there or sort of see okay um the grip of the fastener just off of there Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Oh, oh. Oh, man, is that nice. Um, we'll be able to use it. I'm not doing any inside work for a little bit yet, but man, is that nice. Oh, man, is that nice. Mm. It feels, you know, it just... The interaction that you have is really nice. All right. Well, this is a first impressions video. Um, yeah. Yeah. I'm just now I'm hogging them out because it's because I can. Okay. So I gotta shoot another video on after a little bit of time on these. All right. So what have I noticed? Well, it's a first impression video. I mean, we unboxed. We did that. But what I did notice here, if I'm if I'm really close looking about it, you'll see that the handles are slightly different. Okay, the one on this number two is slightly larger than this one. Okay, the height of it. Okay, you'll notice that there's a slight difference in height. Big deal. Um, the grip. Hmm. You can feel it, the difference in the overall circumference of it. I think I like this little, the version of this on the uh, slotted driver. You can get, this is for a really, you know, you can get really high torque situations on this where, either way, either way. <clears throat> the first, first impression, I got to use these to see what they, uh, see what they are in there I don't, i'm not so sure about the 250 millimeter length i might go with a, like a 100 millimeter length i don't know um I, I forget what that works out to but you can see on the tip itself of the number two just a little bit of stuff that we have there i'm noticing if i if i'm really close you can see just the faintest of rings okay that was from using that on those screws the tip of it, yeah, see, you can't really see. The tip of it, okay, has no discoloration on it. So what that's telling me, even in this little, this, what do we do, two or three screws? I don't know, okay. It grabs the side of the, of the flutes of, grabs the sides. Hmm. Okay. So, if you look very closely, 
you can see that there is a line in there that it looks like there's a secondary heat treating that's right on the edge of the tip where it goes into the fastener itself mm, yes 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 so it looks like they heat treat just the tip of it where it interacts the fastener itself now, that's kind of cool uh the slotted i don't know i don't know but um the the overall fit and finish of it the feel of it is just very high quality uh, i know with my clients when i first get them um uh, you know because you'll lose them and you know lend them out to an apprentice or wherever and it finds its way into somebody else's tools you know, you'll be sitting there at lunch and you come back and your your screwdriver's gone and your coworker goes, Hey, I got your screwdriver. Give it back. And at the end of the day, it never makes it back in your tool. Whatever. That's why I don't let your tools out. But nobody has PB Swiss. So I know when I look at these and I see the color codes, give me back my stuff. But so... That's the first impression. I got. I got to go out in, in the field and work with them. But man, they feel good. They're just the overall balance of them feels good. Who knows? Maybe I might like these two hundred fifty million millimeter extra long ones. I, I don't know. Uh, you know, it gives me that ability to really get in. I don't know. We'll see. But these are very cool. PB Swiss. So you can go into PB Swiss, uh, and that'll take you to the uh, PB Swiss uh, website. And the U.S. distributor is called Count on Tools. But if you go PB Swiss U.S. distributor, it'll take you to what looks like the same PB Swiss site. Um, but it's Count on Tools. And they're uh, nice gals in Georgia. Nice people. Very nice people. Great to do business with. Go over. Check out their stuff. They are the only, 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 only distributor of PB Swiss Tools in America, so you can't buy them on Amazon, you can't get them at Home Depot, you can't get them at Lowe's, you can't get them at your uh, electrical supply houses. Uh, Count on Tools is the only U.S. distributor that I know of that you can pop, you can purchase these. Loving these. Um, so I got to make a follow-up video on these. Uh, I got a couple follow-up videos that I got to do. One is on that uh, Metabo electric screwdriver, and a couple other couple of other uh, things that we're going to work on and we also have a chainsaw tip over that you can see over there that we're working on that 562 with so we're gonna we got a couple of stuff coming up so go check them out pb swiss pb swiss tools these are very cool so this is a number four okay which should fit all of the uh, leviton screws okay number four a number of five is too big and a number six is way too big and a number, uh, I think it's a number two, uh, is is too small, and it rounds them in. <coughs> Excuse me, but number four, which is a little bit smaller than the five sixteenths, so that's what's designed for the Leviton plate screws. And of course, the number two, you got to have a number two. So enough of me draggling and draggling on. All right, guys, thank you so very much. This is a first impressions of these PB Swiss tools. Go check them out. We'll talk to you later. Thanks. Bye-bye.